ねえ、ダメにぐらいだな、みんなにぐらいだ。Rocky is one of the greatest movies ever made. I'll do my best to tell you why in this review, but really, you just have to watch it for yourself. The reason why I love this movie so much is that, yeah, you expect it to be cliched like every other sports movie, but it's really not. It's a well written and timeless movie. The characters in this movie are actually human, they're not just cardboard cutouts doing what you know, you'd expect them to do in any other sports movie. And it's probably got one of the most likable protagonists in any movie in history. So, the story for this movie is that Rocky is a down and out boxer. He's your everyman, you know, he's the lower class citizen, he's just barely scraping by, and you really do feel bad for him. You know, you can relate to him because we've probably all been in that position at one point in our lives. But one day he gets a call from the heavyweight champion of the world, Apollo Creed, who chooses Rocky to be in a fight that、uh, an opponent had dropped out a couple weeks before, and he needs a last minute opponent to fill in. So he chooses Rocky, the Italian stallion.、Urgh! So the characters in this movie are great because they are all so memorable. We've got Sylvester Stallone as Rocky Balboa, who was, does such a great job at playing him. He's so, so likable. You know, he is kind of dumb, but he has a heart of gold. And that's what really makes him so great. He's based off a of real life boxer, Chuck Wepner, who、um, actually inspired Sylvester Stallone to write the movie as he was watching his fight against Muhammad Ali.、Um, Chuck Wepner was a contender in the 1970s, a heavyweight contender. And.、Um, He wasn't expected to go the distance with Muhammad Ali, who was undisputed heavyweight champion at the time. And they said that Ali would knock him out within a couple of rounds. And、uh, Wepner actually went the, the 15 rounds, but、um, 30 seconds, was 30 seconds left in the 15th and final round.、Um, Ali、uh, did a number on him, and they stopped the fight, was 30 seconds left from him going the full distance with Muhammad Ali. He was also based off of Joe Frazier, who was a fellow Philadelphia boxer who used to run down the street every day in his beanie and his、um, sweats and everything like Rocky and run up the art steps of the museum.、Um, he even made a cameo in this movie. He was also the first one to beat Muhammad Ali. And then the final one was, of course, Rocky Marciano, The Rock, only undefeated heavyweight champion、um, to retire undefeated, the 49 and 0. And.、Um, Of course, yeah, you could tell there's a lot of inspiration from him, the name, and you know, he's a fellow Italian boxer and everything like that. Talia Shire, of course, is Adrian! She does a really good job. She's, you know, she's a shy pet shop worker, as we all know and love, you know, the love interest for Rocky.、Um, we also got her brother, p a u l i played by Burt Young, and oh man, you gotta love p a u l i In all the movies, I mean, no matter what he's in, you gotta love p a u l i I mean, he's such an asshole, but at the same time, you love the guy. I mean, I'm pretty sure we all know a friend like p a u l i Then you got Burgess Meredith, you know, an excellent actor. I mean, a lot of people just think of him as the penguin, but he's been in so many movies. He's a really, really great actor. Love Burgess Meredith. But he's B- Mickey, the wise ass, tough trainer that、uh, is whipping Rocky into shape for his big fight with Apollo Creed, played by Carl Weathers, who was based off of Muhammad Ali, you know, with a cocky attitude and things like that. And, you know. Yeah, Carl Weathers. You know, he's Apollo Creed and he was Dylan in The Predator. So, yeah. The characters in this movie are all so likable, they're so iconic that it's impossible not to enjoy this movie. One of the great strengths of this movie is that the story is so well written that yet it's so simple and it engages you in a really great way. So, you know. It's a good thing, and the, the, one of the best parts about this movie is that by the end of the movie, you are rooting for Rocky as if this were a real boxing match. And you really get into it, coupled with the excellent music for this movie by Bill,、uh, Bill Conti, you know, with that iconic scene, the. Who doesn't want to go running after hearing that song? I mean, come on now. That can inspire a lazy fat ass like me to get up and actually do some physical activity, man. I mean, it's a great song. This movie is so much better than I can give it credit for in this review. It's one of those movies that you have to watch, and while you're watching, you can't help but enjoy it. It's such a simple story and didn't have that big of a budget, but it makes for so much better of a movie, probably because it has some of the most relatable characters in movie history and some of the most likable. 
There's a reason why this is one of the greatest movies ever made. I give it a 9 out of 10. So that's it for me. As always, if you like what you see, go ahead and hit subscribe, follow me on Facebook and Twitter. The links are in the description below. And remember, I waste my money so you don't have to. Thanks for watching.